The end is in sight, but not within reach. That's the icebreaker coming to rescue us, Alec. Brilliant. That tiny dot out there, that's the snow dragon, the Chinese rescue icebreaker seen from aboard the stranded Russian ship. An icebreaker that uses the ship's weight as much as 10,000 tons to break through heavy ice. But the Chinese ship is still six nautical miles away, itself blocked by ice up to 10 feet thick. The Chinese captain telling CNN earlier today, the current ice condition is exceeding our capabilities to break through further. It's been nearly 100 hours since the Russian vessel first ran into trouble between Antarctica and New Zealand. Temperatures dropped quickly, freezing the ship in place. We moved as quickly as we could, but the, uh, the ship just couldn't get through. And 74 researchers are on board on a mission to study climate change. The ship and crew are safe and surprisingly in good spirits, posing for photos, tweeting, and even collecting data while they wait to be rescued but they endured a blizzard Thursday. The vessel hasn't moved for the last two days, and we're surrounded by sea ice. We just can't get through. And now the ice is building, closing in. We've got about two to three meters, maybe four in places, wow. uh, surrounding us. And uh, at one point yesterday, the ship was tilting a little bit because of the pressure on one side, because of the most strong easterly winds. And a short time ago, we heard an update from the ship, a tweet from Chris Turney, who says the Snow Dragon is standing by and waiting on another vessel to help. Everyone is well, he says. And on that other vessel is a French icebreaker on its way now to help rescue the rescue ship. Don. <laughs> Fingers crossed, Sunland. Thank you very much for your reporting.